I got to begin this episode with a sad note. I sinned, and I bought a Toyota. <laughs> okay, that's enough. We, bought, we throw the bird. <clears throat> Don't ask me how. Oh, I'm going to show everybody the oil in my truck. Let me show everybody. Look at the oil in my truck. Hey, let me get a close-up of it. That is not bad looking oil for a truck with 224,000 miles on it. Nonetheless, it's been changed every probably three to 5,000 miles and I still threw a bearing. We show you what, uh, 350 motor is not supposed to sound like me. sounds pretty good for a diesel that might be good for a diesel but it's really bad for a 350 Chevrolet so <laughs> God gave me a Toyota <laughs> if anybody wants a truck there it is you get you a deal on it right here this is for a later episode he threw water all over me oh I heard it Woo, the seat look good you even got your keys nope Cause we're gonna crank it up one more time because if I do what I'm thinking about doing today, you won't get crank it for a while. Mm-mm. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> uh, I gotta choke it, Leroy. You can get in it. It's cold. It definitely ain't gonna crank it. How dare you show my ball ahead? Yeah, you make me feel good. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Whoa! I ain't choked it yet, Leroy. Alright now. Ooh, it's cold. It don't want to start. I can't get right. We got an exhaust leak, Mr. Jaden. Take the inside and turn off. What's the oil pressure? They sold us a bad motor. Yeah. That little pump. I was fixing to take transmission out. That's what I was going to do next. I also got to have one. Grab my tools real quick. First thing I'm going to do is hit these belts. So before I do anything. That squealing. Oh. Well, now I'm dirty. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. That oh. gummit! If I open this truck one more time. It's two and oh. It needs to come back like that. I'm gonna tell you what I'm looking forward to most today. I guess is dinner. I guess I we go eat dinner every Saturday after we get done working on my ain't. <laughs> looking too forward to what's going on right now, the way it started. Everybody loves this part, so you might want to get this. They love it when I do stuff, I guess. Bye, loser. Just one more for getting this. Somebody out there watching's got to be going cringing when I do stuff like that. They got to be. I think I've got it.
as tired as I can get it. Up. We'll see what All right. I'm sure it's Put some soap on it. That's what they say. Yeah. We get on the road. <laughs> This Chevrolet Rusty because I'm tired of working on it. I'm too old. Give me a hug. Oh, Rusty. Okay. Japanese Hornet. Ooh. He can have the Camaro. What the heck? What the wolf thing? What did I do? Where'd he come from? He must like gasolines, all I know, because that's all he can smell underneath here. Well, I'll tell you what, probably need to do. Probably need to go eat. That's a good <laughs> idea. Oh, man, I hate to change oil on the car. It looks Man, it's so clean you can't see it on a dipstick. It says it's a quart low, but since the car has dropped two feet on that side, that, that would be about right, because all the oil is running to one side. Stupid. It's probably running the oil away from the dang. But that's probably oh, the reason yeah. it's knocking so bad, because all the oil is away from the dead gum oil pump. It's in the back corner of the pan. So on that note, we're going to take a break. I'm going to use the bathroom, because i got to go. A few moments later. People like burnouts. I could put it in reverse right here and just throw gravel everywhere. Why not? <laughs> I can't find stuff. Oh, what you calling? Okay, Somebody well. want me to go to work? Not today. <laughs> no working today. Unless you count this working, I kind of call it. Being stupid. Playing. <laughs> oh! I have a bad memory. Yeah. I love this piece of junk. It's gonna be the death of me. I'll be right back. I gotta go into the car for a minute. I gotta go say a car prayer. <laughs> the shifter's almost out. It fell out of the... <laughs> oh, now I see why the exhaust pipe is on it. Right there. <laughs> Okay, I'll just have to see if I can get it in reverse like this. If you want to do a burnout, you're going to have to move that. Yeah. I thought it was going to roll off. <laughs> if we are going to change that transmission, it wouldn't hurt to get it on level ground either. You'd have to move cab stroke because we can't go the other way. All I can do is go around and around this thing. <laughs> Cardboard on fire. Look out. Get all the rubber we got. Yeah, on the cardboard. it's actually burning the cardboard. <laughs> Look at all the rubber we got on the car. <laughs> I have a question. We, 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 yeah, it didn't die though. Did you know that? Yeah. Look at that. <laughs> That's good for the Look environment. It's going across top of the house. Look. <laughs> it's going across. Look, way up high. That's Ar just a little burnout. Around here, we like to take care of the environment. That, that's called, look, look, people, that, that's called cooking tars. I can't breathe, Jason, and the car is full. 
There's literally smoke coming out of the car. Yeah, that's what I said. I got out because I was about to die. Well, you might want to let some of that out. <laughs> oh. <laughs> this is rolling. Hey, we might blow the motor too, Jane, but at least we'll have fun doing it. <laughs> there's only $700 I've wasted. Oh, well, back. there's no tire left now. I didn't burn the... No, it's metal. Like, it. there's, there's like literally no tire left. Oh my God, it's going to pop. I hit a rock. The rock dug a hole in it. <laughs> yeah, we won't go anywhere on that. Nope. I'm about to set Burke County on fire, people. The smoke's still wrong. <laughs> <laughs> that ain't engine smoke, neither. That tire smoke. Hey, when we drove it down there and tore the transmission out, we didn't have the exhaust on it, did we? That was just the new pipes. Mm-mm. Cause that thing don't act like it's wanting to go down in gear. I mean, did I check and see that it was going all the way down in gear? Cause I like to never got it in reverse. I'm not sure. Which we drove it down there, didn't we? Mm-hmm. It's still smoking. <laughs> yeah, I know, and I gotta get under there. <laughs> the leaves smoking here. I'm setting Burke County on fire. I set the leaves and the acorns on fire right there. I'm gonna have to put it out. I should've just kept going till it went boom. <laughs> Good night. That's what happens when you do burnouts on a rock. <laughs> <laughs> that took the tread away quick. <laughs> was it smoking good? You was videoing. Oh, yeah. Put it on the other side, then we can do it again. This other one don't move. <laughs> yeah. Next time we'll do it till it pops. Yeah, oh, my God. I got rubber on the, car. Up on the windows and the doors. <laughs> well, what are we going to do besides try to tear the rest of the transmission out? Reverse must be tough. <laughs> I don't know if I want to mess that transmission or not. I don't know what to do. Look at that. Good God. Somebody put out the fire and the tire, man. <laughs> now you got to lay on that? Yeah, I'm going to flip it that way. <laughs> oh, God. <coughs> I got to be careful not to burn myself on that uh, exhaust pipe because I bet it's hot. We're going to have to fire the person that put that exhaust system on. Yeah, he's stunk. <laughs> it's the sorriest job I've ever seen in my life. I just bent the pipe. Ow! I just bent the pipe out of my way. Ow! <laughs> it's always smart to do an epic burnout and then go and touch the muffler. Touch the exhaust pipe. You can see right here the linkage is out right here. I'm gonna put the. I'm gonna see if it'll be easier if I turn it. Put it in neutral or something. Huh? There is still smoke coming out this car door. I know they can't see it on the camera. But there's still tire smoke coming out the car door. <laughs> we didn't set nothing in it on fire, did we? Is the carpet on fire? Nope, that's just epic burnout. That's the way my Chevelle used to do. <laughs> Let's see, it's probably, it's probably in here. Let's see what happens when we pop the trunk. It's gotta be going through, it's seeping through them holes in the trunk up there. <laughs> oh, I found the source. <laughs> Smoking. This is this is what you have to do when uh, you do a burnout. You gotta open Good. every part of the car. Woo! I always love to smell a new paint. Yours is gonna smell like burnt rubber. Good God! Well, at least it'll air out now. <laughs> I hope. Look at it. <laughs> what was did. I doing? I didn't. Did a burnout oh, yeah. for I, no I was reason. under the car, <laughs> but I was going to the car to get something. What was? It? Oh, I was gonna put it in gear. <laughs> Blow, wind, blow. Come on, please blow. Now the car's in neutral. Let's right crawl under it. <laughs> Ow. Oh. Man, we burnt the... They, uh, <laughs> the fluid's running out like... Uh, the transmission fluid out running back here like jelly. <laughs> I, I think we got... It's squirting out the speedometer cable like jelly. I think we got it a little hot this time. That's wore out. The pin fell off of that, but it acts like it's bent and don't want to stay in there. It don't even go far enough to... Ouch! <laughs> what is that, the sixth time you burnt your hand on that? Well, yeah. Exhaust pipe. It looks pretty and new. It's not burnt. Well, it is burnt down here on the ends of it. Well, we smoked this end down here at the tailpipe. Yeah, I think I remember being underneath here with Caleb and checking that.
quieter ground. I'm gonna check the oil, but I don't. I don't see any cause for that except when he sold it to us. It was like that. And why else would he sell a motor for seven hundred dollars? <laughs> I was feeling the core blow. What'd you accomplish today? Well, we found out the motor's going to blow up, and they wasted hours putting it in. That is a quart load, but that still wouldn't make it do that. I hear it already. Yeah. A little driver does you blows, I guess. After we get a transmission. Mm -hmm. I don't see any evidence of rats, but I do see a bunch of mosquitoes. How the flip did they get in there? I'm pretty dang good cameraman too. Yeah, but you're never here. You can tell we don't have no problems. There's like 80 of these laying. There's either transmission fluid or oil. They're all over the place. I know one thing, we ain't never gonna get all the leaves out of this. Look at that. 